So we're gonna put the, put the first piece of this tail end on. So our frame rails are 37 inches to the outside of our inner frame rails. So we're gonna cut a piece at 290 degree angles, 37 inches long. And this is gonna go on the back in the center. We are gonna cut uh, two end pieces, 22 inches long with an 11 degree cut equally, so they're both cut in the same direction like this. And we're going to lay this on top. First thing we're going to do here is put the center piece on. So we're going to take our speed square and we are just going to make sure that this is flush with the back and flush with the sides. Once you got that in place, we're just going to tack it on the back side. Do not tack it on the front side. We're not going to put a weld here. We're going to put a weld under it and on the back side of it. Now, on this corner piece, what we're going to do, I have these little tail light cutouts all over my shop, so. What we're going to do is we're going to clamp that on there to hold this level with this. Set it on here like that. Hold it into place and we're going to tack it. Now once you got the back side of this tacked, we're going to move to this side. This holding this flush so it's flush with this. We're going to grab another clamp and pull this in so that this edge is flush when we put this together. So we're going to pull, put that together. We're going to go ahead and tack that right there. With that all tacked into place, we're going to remove our clamps. Same thing with the other side. So we're going to do the same thing to this side. We're going to put our guide on there. Hold it straight. Now this one I'm going to have to pull in a little bit because this side warped a little when I was welding it, so it's going to look like that. We're going to have to pull that into place. It's going to push that sidebar out just a little bit, but we're going to go ahead and tack this. Make sure it's level here, flush on the back. Make sure it's down all the way, and we're going to tack it on the back. Remove our clamps, make sure that's flush. We're good to move on to the next step. So we're going to put the tail section on. This is a 2x3 120. We're going to cut one 37 inches long and it's going to be welded flush here. We got these two side pieces which are 10 degrees on each end and 23 and 3 quarters and that's going to go right here on these ends. We're going to tack all that together and then uh, we're going to put the tail piece on. 
So we're going to lift our center section up here, put a clamp on it. Just make sure this is level and it's lined up with the edges of your outer bed rails and we're going to tack that on. Next we're going to put on the edges. there and make sure it doesn't rock, make sure it's nice and flat. And when we got that in place, we're just going to tack it. Now we're going to get the tail pieces and put them on.